During the Christian period, a part of Luxor Temple was converted into a church. Till today, we can still see the original carvings and reliefs depicted on the walls, the original walls of the temple, and they are covered with plaster, and there are drawings on these coverings, which are considered Christian drawings. In the middle of the sudden wall of King Amun Hotep III court in Luxor Temple, the access leads us to the hall which once contained eight columns. They were removed in the early Roman period between 60 and 395 AD and the hall was converted into a church. The entrance that led to the sanctuary was closed and turned into a niche. Two granite columns were brought and placed on its sides to turn it into an altar. The beautiful scenes that represented King Amunhotep III were covered by a thick layer of plaster on which the Coptics drew religious Christian drawings. Today, we can distinguish few colored faces gazing towards a priest. Most probably, they represent the Coptics praying in this hall. Age revealed the hidden truth of that hall when parts of the plaster fell down and the original scenes were exposed. Now, we can see the king in his relationship with different gods and goddesses. No matter which religions were practiced on the Egyptian land, Egypt has always been a religious country. And above the shoulder of these religions, a great civilization was built to last. <laughs>